परसेंटेज ऑफ स्टील रे एनफोर्समेंट इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ आर सी सी स्लेप बीम कॉलम एंड फुटिंग सो दिस इज अ शॉर्ट वीडियो बट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड दिस शॉर्ट वीडियो सो यू कैन कमेंट्स आई विल रिस्पॉन्ड यू एज यू कैन सी गाइज इन दिस कॉलम वी हैव बार बेंडिंग मेंबर्स इन बार बेंडिंग मेंबर्स वी हैव डिफरेंट आर सी सी स्ट्रक्चर एट दिस साइड गाइज यू कैन सी वी हैव परसेंटेज ऑफ स्टील रे एनफोर्समेंट फॉर डिफरेंट आर सी सी स्ट्रक्चर If you see, guys, in bar bending members, slab is our CC structure. So, in a slab, you can use one percent of total volume of concrete. It means, if the slab concrete volume is anything, so from that volume, we have one percent of steel in the construction of our CC slab. So, these value we got from the thumb rule. uh and also you can use the uh, bn data uh, recommendation okay so you will find also more accurate values from that so this is thumb rule okay so for slab construction we used 1% of the total volume of concrete what is the volume of concrete length of the slab width of the slab and thickness of the slab so you will get the total volume so from that total volume we used 1% of steel volume okay so this is percentage of steel now the next uh, structure is beam so for beam we are using 2% of steel okay so 2% of total volume of concrete so how you can get the volume of beam so length or length of the beam then depth of the beam and width of the beam you will find the total volume of the beam then you can find from the total volume of concrete you can find the total uh, steel reinforcement which is 2% of the total volume of concrete especially for beam for the column we required 2.5% so you can use up to 2.5% but not more than this because this is the high value for rcc column next for the footing so for the footing construction we used 0.8% of total volume of concrete what is the total volume of concrete for footing so from that volume we used 1% of a uh, 0.8% of steel reinforcement okay next guys the standard length of the steel bar is 12 meter okay which is 40 feet so this is the standard length of steel reinforcement next guys weight of steel bar for the length okay weight of steel bar for length okay so you can use the formula d square divided by 162 where d is die of steel in millimeter for example if the length of the steel bar is 12 meter or 40 feet with 10 millimeter die of steel rod then the weight of the bar is d square divided by 162 and multiply 12 then you will get the value 7.4 kg steel is required uh, so weight is uh, for 10 mm of steel rod if the length is 12 m or 40 ft so this is the formula by which you can find the total weight of steel rod suppose if you need the weight of steel for 1 m and the diameter is 10 mm so therefore 1 m is equal d square divided by 162 so as i discussed here the d square d should be in mm so therefore d square divided by 162 so 10 mm multiply 10 mm divided by 162 you will get the value 0.61 kg so this is the weight of steel for 1 m as you can see here so therefore if you have 12 m so 0.61 uh, kg multiply 12 then you will get the value 7.4 kg so one link which is 12 12 meter or 40 feet so if the dia is 12 uh, if the dia, uh, dia is 10 mm so uh, we have the weight 7.4 kg so if the dia is 12 mm okay so you can use the same formula d square divided by 162 so therefore 12 multiply 12 multiply 162 you will get the value 0.88 kg so this is for per meter okay if you have 12 meters so 0.88 kg multiply 12 then you will get the one length total length as you can see here okay so this is a short video to guide you for percentage of steel for slab beam column and footing thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye